Boston City Councilor has one thing in common with Mayor Tom Menino. They both hail from Hyde Park. Last Thursday, Rob Consalvo kicked off his campaign in hopes of having something else in common with Menino. He's one of a couple of dozen candidates vying to succeed the mayor, and now I'm joined by that very same Rob Consalvo. Rob, great to see you. Thanks for being here. Glad to be here. I saw at your kickoff, you're in front of a sign saying, Making Boston Better. Where did Tom Menino not make it good enough? Well, it's not, I don't think that the mayor didn't make it good enough. Look, there's nobody that did more for the city mm -hmm. than our mayor, and nobody that's been more committed to the neighborhoods and to really moving Boston forward. What this is about, what's my vision, what's the candidate's vision for grabbing the mayor's baton and moving the city even further forward. Should we, I, I am a fan of Tom Menino's too, but I have yet to find a candidate, now you're included, who is willing to voice one criticism of the mayor. How do you lead a city? When the conventional wisdom is, if I say a bad word about the mayor, oh my goodness, what's going to happen to me? You know, that's not what it is. I don't think it's about what's going to happen. I think there's a real respect for people in public service for what he's done. The, the fact of the matter is, all of us don't agree all the time on issues. The mayor and I have had disagreements. What's we, a major disagreement that you think would affect this? Uh, it's a major disagreement that would carry forward in the future, Rob Consalvo. In terms of? With you and the mayor, with, in terms of your leadership as opposed to as compared to his. Look, what I tell folks in that situation is, for me, it's not fine about what the mayor did or didn't do right or did wrong. This is about what 